Hello, my name is Mac, and believe it or not, this application is not for me. I've been a space fan my whole life, and my dream has been to go to space ever since I was a child. Dreams change. See, I've been fortunate enough to probably afford to do it on my own, so my dreams have changed. My goal now is to actually send someone else. This application is for Space for Humanity to send a young lady named Budur, who I met in a refugee camp in Jordan, to space, not only to fulfill her dreams, but also to open the door to millions of other people, to show them that if the most unfortunate person in the world can actually make it to space, then space is truly for everyone. Now, I found out about Space for Humanity at IAC 2019. I actually ran into Sarah Kretas, and she told me about Space for Humanity, that I really need to reach out to you guys, and I figured, what a way to do so. You see, I'm kind of doing something similar through my company, Borderless Labs. More on that later. Now, this is all about sending Badur to space. Take a look. This is Badur. She is extremely passionate about science and space. She wants to be an astronaut and astronomer. I want to be an astronaut and astronomer too. We met in a Syrian refugee camp in Jordan at the Relief International Center. And on our recent trip across four different continents, we had the opportunity to meet more inspiring kids just like her. But to explain, I need to start at the beginning. Hello, my name is Boudour. I am a Syrian refugee, but I live in Jordan right now in a refugee camp, but I'm going to be leaving soon to become an aerospace engineer. If you send me to space, then you will have a dedicated ambassador to humanity. We share the same values. Your mission is very important to me. This can inspire school and university students everywhere. In doing so, I'll be able to spread the science and the importance of learning in life. Space is for everyone. If you send me to space, then you can prove to humanity that anyone, I mean anyone, who ever dreams of being an astronaut or going to space someday can make their dreams become true. Going to space would allow me to learn a lot from people from different cultures and civilizations in the world and take advantage of their expertise. In addition, it will help me build my character and give me great experiences in life. These days, she spends her days being a science communicator. She's already being a hero in her own right. If anyone deserves the right to go to space, if anyone who's going to spend the rest of their life being an ambassador to STEAM, STEM education, women's education, diversity, human rights, Boudour was made for this role. So what do you say? Let's send her to space. Dear Boudour, this video is an encouragement for you from me, Dottie Metcalf Lindenberger, uh, a woman who had a chance to fly in space. I'm encouraged by your strength to have flown Syria and be in Jordan learning and trying to do your absolute best to understand astronomy. I was a little girl once dreaming about going to space and I wasn't even sure that was really possible. But I think if you remain curious and you pursue your education, you will accomplish your big dreams. Hi, I'm Matt Cap. I'm the host of Planetary Radio. Hey, Mr. Wonderful here. Big shout out to Borderless Labs because of the story of the door. Budor, so I hear you want to go to space. I kind of know a thing or two about that. Bodor, it looks like you might be going to space before me. I'm so inspired by your passion and love for steam and space. Thanks to Borderless Labs and your hard work, you're going to be out of that refugee camp soon. So I wish you the greatest of luck with this project. And uh, I will also add Ad Astro, which is Latin for to the stuff. You go, girl. We need women like you up there. I refuse to be a victim. 
So Sarah, are you going to tell my story? Bye bye bye.